Hello everyone, welcome back. In this session, we would learn how to solve the practice problem cyclically rotate one element of a given array. Okay, so first understand the question and then we would solve it. So basically, in this question, we are given an array. Let's say one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, we just need to move one element in clockwise direction. So that means this five, the last element, needs to come in the front. Okay. So my output would be 5, 1, 2, 3 and okay. So this is what I have to do. I hope the question is clear to you. Now let's move forward to the solution part. Okay. You need to go to the practice portal first. In practice portal in the difficulty choose basic. Okay. Then find the problem. Cyclically rotate an array by 1. Okay. Cyclically rotate an array by 1. Okay. Once you find the problem, click on solve. Okay. So let's read the question. Given an array, rotate the array by one position in clockwise direction. Okay. So this is the example that I just explained you. And we need to code over here. Okay. So let's start. Okay. Let's code it. Enter. First x equal to array n minus 1. This is the last element. Okay. Enter. For i in range okay now what is the range n minus 1 again last element colon enter array i need to add an element right in the start n minus i plus 1 okay then equal to array n minus i plus 2 i am swapping the positions so basically over here i am saying the first element would go to, like the first element is at the 0th position, would move to the first position, okay. Then the element at the first position would move to the second position and so on. Why? Because the element at the last position is taking the first position now, okay. I hope the part is clear to you. Now let's move forward, okay. Now basically array 0th position that is the first element would be x okay x i have declared in the start over here okay now finally i just need to return with my array right one minute so over here backspace over here return with what return with my array now i need to check if the solution is correct or not so i would click on compile and run okay so let's wait Compilation is completed and basically my output is matching with the expected output. So now I would submit the given problem. Okay, so let's wait. Problem is solved successfully and this is how you solve the practice problem. Cyclically rotate one element in a given array. I hope this video was helpful for you and you guys enjoyed it. If you guys have enjoyed the video, make sure you click on the like button and subscribe our channel. And thank you for joining me today. Thank you.